டெக்கான் ரம்மி டிஸ்கிரிப்ஷனில் இருக்கும் லிங்கை கிளிக் செய்து இருபது லட்சம் வெல்லும் வாய்ப்பை பெறுங்கள் உடனடி வேலை வாய்ப்பிற்கான உயர் கல்வியை வழங்கும் அசட் இன்ஸ்டிடியூட் ஆப் டெக்னாலஜி சென்னை மற்றும் கோவை கிரேட் திங்ஸ் அபவுட் அஜித் ஹி கேன் ஷோ பெயின் டிஸ்பைட் ஹிஸ் ஃபேர் காம்ப்ளெக்ஷன் தேர் இஸ் அன் எபிலிட்டி டு கன்வே வல்னரபிலிட்டி விச் ஐ திங்க் மேக்ஸ் அஜித் வெரி யூனிக் when we are doing roja roman of course was new that time itself i used to like him even though he was not very big as a new boy he's only 21 22 years old in fact uh, after he took uh, six songs for roja the rest of the tunes i took for a film which uh, my brother and i did in malayalam <laughs> called uh, yodha over kalagattathil or sila visuals important a irukku ipa நம்ம தமிழ் சினிமா எடுத்து பார்த்தீங்கன்னா எல்லா படத்துலேயும் ஒரு டாஸ்மேக் பார் இருக்கும் நிறைய பேர் தாடி வச்சுட்டு இருப்பாங்க அவங்க லுங்கி கட்டிக்கிட்டு இந்த டாஸ்மேக் பார்க்குள்ள ஒரு பாட்டு இருக்கும் Rajini sir has a very big advantage. When he is in frame, everyone is only look at him. When I saw Talapati and that big backlight on him and the way Rajini sir had turned and he was looking like that, I thought, you know, I'm seeing uh, somebody like Lion King, you know, he had the quality of a lion. Yeah. சின்ன சின்ன ஆசை ஸ்டார்ட் பண்றதுக்கு முன்னாடி ஒரு மூணு ஷாட்ல ஒரு பலூன் வச்சுட்டு ஒரு ஷாட் இன்னைக்குலி பட் அப்ப ஒரு இனோவேஷனா இருந்தது எப்படி தென்ன மேல கேமரா போறது ஐயோ கேமரா எங்கேயோ போறது ஐ நெவர் ஃபவுண்ட் எனிபடி ஹூ கன்சர்வ்ஸ் இஸ் எனர்ஜி சோ மச் இஸ் விஜய் ஹி ஓன் டாக் இல் ஆல்வேஸ் பி லுக்கிங் அட் த ஃபுளோர் He is very quiet all the time. It's just one take, it will be like perfect. Minimum energy, maximum impact. If you are interested in the film, you have a point of direction. So what made you do that? You have to do the camera with a camera. Why are you directing me? I have made the directors, but why are you directing me? Why are you directing me? Hey! Thank you for accepting me for this interview. I'm very happy to see you guys in the interview. That's why it's a very different platform also through Skype. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> it's different. And Rajiv sir, you know, it's different. And Rajiv sir, you know, it's different. Cinematography, visuals, you know, it's different. 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 இந்த மாதிரி நிறைய மெட்டபர்ஸ் யூஸ் பண்ணி கம்பாரிசன்ஸ் பண்றாங்க இல்லையா இந்த கம்பாரிசன் பத்தி என்ன நினைக்கிறீங்க அதே சமயம் அவ்வளவு போயிட்டிக்கான ஒரு விஷுவல் புல் அவுட் பண்றது அப்படிங்கறது ஒரு பெரிய ப்ராசஸ் இல்லையா அத பத்தி அதை உங்களுக்கு அது என்ன விஷயம் சொன்னா ஒரு படத்தினோட ரெவியூ எழுதும் போது ஒரு டுவெண்டி லைன் ரெவியூ எழுதும் போது போட்டோகிராஃபிக்கு ஒரு லைன் தான் இருக்கு அவனுக்கு தெரிஞ்ச நாலேஜ் வச்சு அவன் அந்த போட்டோகிராஃபி நல்லா இருக்கா பரவாயில்லையா இந்த மாதிரி எழுதணும் இஃப் இஸ் ஒர்க் இஸ் நாட் வெரி குட் எஸ் இஸ் படத்துக்கு ஏத்த மாதிரி விஷுவல்ஸ் எடுத்திருக்காருன்னு சொல்லுவாரு தட் மீன்ஸ் நீங்க கோல் அடிச்சு நீங்க அவுட் தே டோன்ட் கன்சிடர் போட்டோகிராஃபி ஆஸ் சம்திங் கிரேட் தே கன்சிடர் போட்டோகிராஃபி ஆஸ் டூல் தட் தே கேன் யூஸ் பட் வாட் தே கன்சிடர் கிரேட் இஸ் பெயிண்டிங் பெயிண்டிங் பார்க்காதவங்க கூட சொல்லுவாரு சார் உங்க ஷார்ட்ஸ் பெயிண்டிங் மாதிரி இருக்கு சார் தட் மீன்ஸ் இஸ் டெல்லிங் இட் இஸ் குட் தட் மீன்ஸ் இஸ் சேங் த காம்பசிஷன்ஸ் ஆர் குட் ஸோ எனக்கு நான் படம் பண்ணும்போது ஃபர்ஸ்ட் டூ த்ரீ ஃபிலிம்ஸ் அன்இன்சிக்னிஃபிகன்ட் ஃபிலிம்ஸ் பண்ணிட்டு ஃபைனலாக ஒரு பம்பாய் படம் பண்ணும்போது இட் இஸ் தி ஆப்போசிட் ஆஃப் பெயிண்டிங் தட் வி ஆர் ட்ரைங் பிகாஸ் வி ஆர் ட்ரைங் டு டூ திங்ஸ் விச் ஆர் லுக்கிங் லைக் நியூஸ் ரீல் ஒரு ராயட் எப்படி ரியலிஸ்டிக் ஆக்குறது அது அதை நம்ம எப்படி மெட்ராஸ் ஸ்டேஜ் பண்ணி அது பம்பாய் மாதிரி காமிக்கிறது ஸோ தே ஆர் டிகிரேடிங் அண்ட் இமேஜ் டு ஆக்சுவலி கெட் இட் So, mm-hmm. in, in the, in the process, it is exactly the 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 process, it it is 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 exactly exactly opposite of OVM or and the perfect frame. We chaos in the capture. So, So, I was pretty sure that uh, audience and uh, people are not going to notice it, but we try it. And that is what happened. Some set of people are not going to be able to do it. Some people appreciate it. So, ஒரு ரிஸ்க் எடுத்து நம்ம நம்மளுடைய இன்டர்பிரிட்டேஷன் நம்ம ஒரு ஒர்க்கு கொடுக்கும் போது அந்த ஒர்க்கு அந்த கதையினால் டிப் டிபெண்டண்டாக இருக்கு அது எப்படி ஏன்னா ஆடியன்ஸ் எடுத்துப்பாங்க அல்லாட்டி ஒரு கிரிட்டிக் எடுப்பாங்க நமக்கு தெரியாது அந்த இந்த வேர்டு நீங்கள் யூஸ் பண்ணுறீங்களே பெயிண்டிங் மாதிரி இருக்குன்னு சொல்லும்போது அந்த ஃப்ரேம்ஸ் அவ்வளோ பியூட்டிஃபுல்லாக இருக்கு பட் த அதர் ஆஸ்பெக்ட் நீங்கள் சொன்னீங்க போயிட்ரி மாதிரி இருக்குன்னு சொல்லும்போது தட் அது இட்ஸ் அ காம்பினேஷன் ஆஃப் மெனி திங்ஸ் 
முதல்ல நம்ம ஒரு படம் எடுக்கும் போது நம்ம கம்போஸ் பண்றோம் அதுல நம்ம என்ன லென்ஸ் சூஸ் பண்றோம்னு இருக்கிற அந்த காம்போசிஷன் இஸ் டிசைடட் பை சாய்ஸ் ஆஃப் லென்ஸ் அதுக்கு பிறகு வி ஆர் அந்த சப்ஜெக்டை கொண்டு வந்து நின்றுட்டு ஹவ் ஆர் வி லைட்டிங் இட் அதுல ஒரு கலர் சாய்ஸ் அதுக்கப்புறம் மூவ்மெண்ட் இது எல்லாமே இணைந்து வருது தான் அந்த ஒரு மூடு வருது அந்த மூடு நீங்க கிரியேட் பண்றது கதையோட ஒரு கனெக்ஷன் இருக்கணும் இட் ஷுட் அந்த உங்களோட கதையை இன்னும் ரியலிஸ்டிக் ஆகி மக்கள் கிட்ட போய் சேர்ற மாதிரி ஒரு யூஸ் இருந்தா தான் அது பண்ண முடியும் முடியுது <laughs> <laughs> i think you know basically if you are really deeply into the story then a lot of things become believable a lot of times for uh, sometimes in malayalam films to quite a bit chalu pella kai nokki da react panadu maybe the other actor is not even there so a lot of it is make believe it is like i said the combination of all the work and i think sometimes uh, even though we might not have uh, gone to that location we would have studied it quite a bit before actually trying to recreate it so that recreating is uh, what makes it work like rajiv was saying when you have to do the riots you would have definitely have an idea that this is how it would have happened and you would try to do what can be done in the best way actually. so basically i think every film is a challenge sometimes you do a film because the director is your friend sometimes you have to do a film uh, for something else you know sometimes you really want to do something different and so you do like that so every time you end up with a whole new experience you know every time you do a film it is never the same actually so nange na enna na namu or padam pannadhukku munnadi na indha film na or or arc dedicate pannu andha mari na manasil vekku varu okay appo nama andha mari vekkumbodhu nama tired aagadhu nama passionate ah work pannuvaru but i try to do one thing which i always try to do that is Uh, i don't mind risking it you know mm. uh, i will like to be on the edge ninga work panna sir nadigargaloda per solva avanga kitta distinctive ana sila interesting ana features irukum illaya adu mattum ninga solanum so first i'll start with the uh, santoshivan sir rajini sir kitta irukra or feature that you consider is very distinctive interesting or beautiful if you want to say rajini sir has this very big advantage when he is in frame everyone will only look at him because he has that radiance you know he takes away all the attention then the next one point is that he's just not during acting that he's very active he's very active all the time you know that makes it easier for you to for him to play a little younger because he's not a slow and he's exactly like he was uh, before only now the difference is that now he goes to gym and all that and he was showing me videos of some heavy gym sequence which he had done on his own and those that is why they actually because he showed those gym videos only he there was a sequence like that in the movie it is not done with fake things and all that he is actually doing it yeah so i think uh, as he grows older it keeps him going because he loves what he is doing and he enjoys it himself i used to ask him why don't you do when are you going to do another film with mani ratnam and things like that you know <laughs> but now he's in is doing a lot of lot of films i think now but yeah. uh, he told me that he loves working all the time which is sir i have worked with him in tupaki so angrita or a feature edavu see he is actually a, a very experienced actor also you know he has actually developed as he has come up because you see his earlier films now he has got into some other league altogether and he also is a very confident but it's just like uh, rajini sir in a way he loves what he is doing but he's also very disciplined he will only work till so long but when he is there he is always there he keeps to himself all the time but he is a very interesting person to know if you actually uh, meet him like that you know in fact uh, i met him recently at uh, that film at least that i met him because i had gone to uh, sign uh, yogi babu and uh, so i met him and we had a long chat and all that stuff so i think you know every time you see the same enthusiasm and all that which i think uh, is what makes all the all these actors i think have some kind of a radiance which makes it 
very interesting uh, when they meet people or something like that you know so i feel that all of them have something similar also in that respect sir rajesh sir ungalude perspective na kekka virumbara from mamudi sir ajit sir arvind swami sir i think uh, mamudi he looks like he's a guy who is um, very masculine and um, almost they edukida ing munadi ella vandu nikringa ingen keda keda hai get get out of my sight and the or standard or rough uh, military general or quality irukku avaru it's very difficult uh, if you have to take mamuti and say that he is like a bindangoli or he is a vulnerable person you will have to work very hard on the script but he has that aura of invincible but in real life mamuti is a very sweet person and he is very thing but when he comes to the screen he has that quality i think one of the great things about um, ajit is that he also communicates a sense of vulnerability you know i mean okay. he has a, he can show pain uh, very fast right now you are seeing a lot of films where he is an angry man but i kind of saw that despite his fair complexion despite his good looks uh, there is an ability to convey a vulnerability which i think makes ajit very unique you know uh i think uh, and uh, that's what i tried to do in kandugondin with him because or panakarnai vandu cinema la or ir assistant director ay kashtapadumbodu he has he there is something believable about him uh, i think that is a very interesting arvin swami has a kind of a urban or intelligent look you know he look padichavare he has got a, a view on things and in life as well as on screen he communicates intelligence you know and i think um, uh he is very good looking and he has a uh, kind of an he transformed the way uh, people saw the south indian male so all over you know, you know india roja vandupo he was the ideal guy people wanted to get married to right so they would always write arvind swami kind of a person because he looked like an urban sophisticated person and i think he revolutionized the way uh, heroes looked i mean he didn't look like a chap a lot of heroes you know like they look like they were born and brought up in the film industry uh, arvin doesn't look like a guy who is born and brought up in the film industry he looks like a person who is educated who is knowledgeable and who is thing and therefore i think he um, fitted so well into a lot of maniratnam's films you know so i think each face is uh, has a certain what i call sthai bhava i mean that is the basic note and then it is what the role demands that they change themselves to and that's a quality of the actor to change himself interesting uh, I, i thought uh, uh, arvind did a very good job in tani uruvan he tried did something completely different you know and romba nalla irundathu so similarly ajit has done completely different kind of roles in Uh, some f- film where he's even done a role of a person who is playing a dancer and you know he, he, he can, everybody tries uh, to do different kinds of things yeah. mamuti has played a role of a carnatic musician so you know people have done so many different that's the that's what the role does but the main right. emotion that they communicate is that you know I, even when um, when i saw talapathi and that big backlight on him and the way rajini sir had turned and he was looking like that i thought you know i'm seeing uh, somebody like lion king you know he had the quality of a lion yeah. uh, and the the that that charisma of the lion you know he had that animal like quality to his walking and it's um, some kind of attraction that you feel for bruce lee and with a lion mix is what i feel rajini sir has you know wow. <laughs> and i have shot with uh, vijay sir as well as suresh sir in lot of commercials but not in a film and uh, i have never found anybody who conserves his energy so much as uh, vijay he won't talk he'll always be looking at the floor and he doesn't he's very quiet all the time and then you show the dance he'll say okay and then in <laughs> just one take it'll be like perfect minimum energy maximum impact is uh, <laughs> is very graceful when he dances each person has as he said a different quality a charisma to it so ajit sir vandu vidyasamana characters roles nariya padiranga appdi neenga sonninga 
சந்தோஷ் சார் ஒன் சட்ஸ் ரோல் இஸ் இஸ் ரோல் இன் அசோகா அவர் பண்ண இது வரைக்கும் பண்ண ஒரே பாலிவுட் ஃபிலிம் வந்து அசோகா தான் ஸோ எப்படி வந்து அந்த தருணத்துல அஜித் சார் அதுல காசு போகணும்னு நீங்க நினைச்சீங்க Ah, uh, because I used to re- I like Ajit very much, you know. Because I like the way he looks and I like also the way he actually, you know. Uh, I always thought that he is someone who could do other languages very easily, actually, you know. Uh, and it would be very easily acceptable because he had uh, that charisma and also the good looks and the talent, which was amazing, actually. So that is uh, how I did. Everyone wants to do different kinds of things. which is very interesting because even in cinematography we guys try to do like try to pick every rasa in the navarasa so if you you can you can actually split it into so many different phases like top light also you can actually do some shooting so just like that these people actually love the fact that i think they fall in love with the camera whatever but the fact is that they always want to do different kind of things so unga rendu perudaiya visuals um ar raman sir udaiya music um such an amazing combination edha or part illa edha or moment rehman oda edha or piece of music kete adha poi odane shoot pannu ngra or enthusiasm vandiruka avangalukku can you recall such uh, memories uh, yeah actually um, uh, uh, when we are doing roja rehman of course was new and uh, so mani me and the rehman we stayed in a beach resort and he would do all this music and then we would uh, he composed quite a bit of music actually that time then we went to see on locations we would uh, when we go to see locations we would listen to this music okay and now i liked most of the tunes that he did in fact uh, after he took uh, six songs for roja the rest of the tunes i took for a film which uh, my brother and i did in malayalam <laughs> called uh, yodha. yodha yeah yodha. so uh, so from that time itself i used to like him even though he was not very big the producer said is a new boy he's only 21 22 years old we let us have someone and uh, then they used to naturally when someone comes out with something new people tend to do that but after that i was shooting rudali and, and i made dimple kapadia listen to these songs long time before it was released before it was released actually and uh, uh, dimple kapadia told me this is amazing santosh boy don't you have a indie you know like that and also i felt that you yourself when he was doing um, you know when you when you listen saw the film and everything it lifted everything and this went on into other languages also actually so that is good actually i think you know always uh, in not only that i think even cinematography wise also it complemented it like uh, like in bombay and like in so when everything goes together you know people get an experience which you can't put a pinpoint it on you know when it is a very good collaboration and everything seems right then it really works very well i guess yeah and rajesh sir ungulude padangalude paadangal abingiradhu vandu visually enna solrudhu locations ah irukatom costumes ah irukatom adhu vera or league la irukum but oru part oru part venile venile part mattum ore set la irukum ore costume da but still it was so beautifully shot adhula oru 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 inni varaikume vandu adhu regular ah ninga ipo poi paatha kuda or recent comment youtube la and the song killer irukum so the ideation for that venile venile song adha kuda solla mudiyuma valkama paattu nu sonna you know paattu vandale theater la oru 20 per elundhu poi cigarette pudipaanga appadi oru kaala irundhathu so uh, when maniratnam came in and the new vidamana song picture realization came in the idea was avangala theater la indu veliye pogura people must come to the theater for seeing the songs so from uh, time passed it became a element which neenga adu miss pannitingna edavadhu neenga story la miss pannuvinga so even when you are introducing the girl in uh, in roja chinna chinna aase neenga paakalena ungalku and the ponnoda character puriyadhu so oh. hero in introduction song and the nature la and the ponnu irukirathu was uh, that element of making music integral to the storytelling had started with maniratnam thing now what we why you see in the case of uh, in uh, vennilave song is that uh, that is replacing a scene or payan or vera ponnai sekkaradukaga varumbodu they fall in love 
இதுதான் மேட்டர் என்டையர் படத்தோட ஒரு ஒரு மெயின் சாராம்சம் இஸ் ஹேப்பனிங் இன் தட் த்ரீ அண்ட் ஹாஃப் மினிட்ஸ் ஸோ அந்த கதையில் இவ்வளோ பெரிய ஒரு மேட்டர் நடக்கும்போது நீங்கள் கட் பண்ணி கட் பண்ணி பத்து லொக்கேஷன் காமிக்க வேண்டாம் அதை கொரியோகிராஃபியும் இதுலேயும் அது பர்ஃபெக்டாக எடுத்தால் யூ கேன் கெட் இட் ஸோ அதுக்கு முன்னாடி அந்த மியூசிக்கல்ஸ் ஸ்டடி பண்ணிட்டு இந்த சிங்கிங் இந்த ரீன் அந்த மாதிரி இருக்கிற நிறைய மியூசிக்கல்ஸ் பார்த்துட்டு அதை எப்படி கொரியோகிராஃப் பண்ணி எப்படி ஒரு மூணு கிளைமேக்ஸ் ஏன்னா ஒவ்வொரு சரணத்துக்கு ஒரு மூவ்மெண்ட் அந்த சரணத்துக்கு எண்டில் ஒரு கிளைமேக்ஸ் திருப்பி ஒரு கிளைமேக்ஸ் ஸ்டார்ட் பண்ணுறோம் ஸோ அந்த 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 படத்தில் ஒரு மூணு கிளைமேக்ஸ் இருக்கும்போது மூணு லொக்கேஷன் வருது ஆல்ரெடி மூணு காஸ்ட்யூம் சேஞ்ச் வரும் இதில் நெரட்டிவாக நீங்கள் எப்போ நான் அவளை பார்க்க ஆரம்பிச்சிட்டேன் எப்போ எனக்கு இன்ட்ரெஸ்ட் வருது எப்போ எனக்கு கண்ட்ரோல் பண்ண முடியாமல் நான் அவளை பிடிக்கிறேன் அதுக்கப்புறம் அவ ஏத்து பாரா இல்லையா இந்த இந்த மூணு ஸ்டேஜஸும் ஒரு பாட்டுக்குள்ள இருக்கு சோ ஐ டோன்ட் திங்க் யூ நீட் டு சேஞ்ச் எ லொகேஷன் when there is so much narrative happening inside a song great sir interesting நல்ல ஒரு இன்சைட் இன்சைட்ஃபுல்லா இருந்தது உங்களுடைய பதில் சந்தோஷ் சார் உங்களுக்கு தான் நான் ஒரு விஷயத்தை காட்டணும் something that uh, rajiv sir had sent me <laughs> that's uh, rajiv sir's family yeah. killed by your father it seems do you remember that yeah i'm, I'm sure when your rajiv was telling me actually <laughs> yeah the, very very sweet yeah very <laughs> with a <the> gun <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah you, you know the one, one of the peculiar things that um, unite us uh, other than the fact that we both are wedded to the you know camera and things like that is that um, when i was a child i my father was the adc to the governor in um, in in kerala the most famous photographer in town happened to be Santosh's father Mr Shivan and Shivan Studios so my childhood pictures in Trivandrum were taken by Santosh's father wow <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 and the family picture what happened is that uh, my I just call call my mother to ask her what happened there was um, my younger brother started crying because he was taken to the studio which was Shivan Studios and um, because he started crying So Santosh's father gave him a biscuit and he's holding on to the biscuit and that's how he took the picture. That's a good one, yeah. Yeah, actually, you know, uh, my dad used to do a lot of uh, photos of us also as kids, you know. So if I became a doctor, there were a picture like that. Uh, if I was a cinematographer, there was a picture like that. And of course, I used to meet a lot of uh, people also because he was very much into photojournalism. So he had a lot of political, you know, people he used to, he, used to, he would shoot a lot of political people and all that and also now recently i made a documentary on him for the kerala uh, film academy media academy so you two people have come from artistic background and come from who are your earliest influences sir uh, cinematography visual jethapur porthu varaikum my early influences were basically uh, observation because i used to sketch a lot when you sketch you tend to look at things a little more deeply than just when you're taking pictures so you realize there's nothing called perfect and the imperfection is what is making interesting you know my father used to have a very strange way of teaching actually he would not teach you anything like that but he would tell when i was just after school i said i want to learn photography uh, seriously so he said okay go ahead and uh, wipe all those gandhi pictures in the hall so i used to uh, wipe it and it went on for 3 days but after oh. that he had to then he would ask me questions how the picture was taken where there was a window where did the light come from so he wanted to know whether i really was doing it the pictures or just doing wiping you know like <laughs> that so it's a very different way of teaching those days actually interesting so you, yeah. you tend to learn because you started observing it more so when i answered he looked at me and said oh you're very good and all that and then i think first time he led me to his library and i got a copy of the american society of cinematography magazine as a first time i actually had a look at it and it was very interesting so i started writing my name sadosh shivan asc then my wow. dad said well, you have to do something much more to get where if you want to be one of them like that so i think these are that time i was very hurt actually because he didn't like the fact that i wrote so i think sometimes it is good to be hurt fail people uh, getting frustrated people not um, uh, accepting you so all these actually propel you to do your own thing as I agree. At least right. in my journey, it's like that. Yeah. Cinematography is not just about Aragana visuals. It's 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 not just about Aragana visuals. What else do you 
love doing with your camera uh, wishes of birth varaikum uh, actually ipa or kaalathile namma and color photography vanda time la oru nalla pacha pachaya irukkira oru greenery ooti la poi edukkirathu that was very important adukku munnadi neenga paathina பிஃபோர் ஊட்டி பிகேம் ஃபேமஸ் எல்லாருமே இந்த டேம்ல எல்லாம் போய் போட்டோ இப்போ பாட்டெல்லாம் நல்லா பளிச்சுன்னு இருக்கிற வெயில்ல டேம்ல போய் ஷூட் பண்ணுவாங்க ஏன் டேம்ல எடுத்தாங்கன்னு எனக்கு தெரியாது பட் டேம் வாஸ் கன்சிடர்ட் வெரி இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் ஸோ அந்த மாதிரி ஒவ்வொரு காலகட்டத்தில் ஒரு சில விஷுவல்ஸ் இம்பார்ட்டண்டா இருக்கும் இப்ப நம்ம தமிழ் சினிமா எடுத்து பார்த்தீங்கன்னா எல்லா படத்துலயும் ஒரு டாஸ்மேக் பார் இருக்கும் நிறைய பேர் தாடி வச்சுட்டு இருப்பாங்க அங்க லுங்கி கட்டிக்கிட்டு இந்த டாஸ்மேக் பார்க்குள்ள ஒரு பாட்டு இருக்கும் ஸோ ஒரு ஒரு குறிப்பிட்ட காலத்துல ஒரு விஷுவல் மக்களை ரொம்ப அது இன்ஃபுளுன்ஸ் ஆகி அதுல எல்லா படத்துலயும் அந்த ஷார்ட் வர ஆரம்பிச்சிடும் பட் இஃப் யூ லுக் அட் வை பீப்புள் ஆர் டேக்கிங் சம்திங் முதல்ல நீங்க கலர் வரும்போது கலர் கரெக்டா வருதா இல்லையா ஏன்னா வைல் போட்டோ ஜேர்னலிசம் வாஸ் லார்ஜ்லி பிளாக் அண்ட் ஒயிட் திஸ் வார் பாட் அவுட் கலர் ஸோ since vietnam was this war was largely to do with greenery we started saying why can't we shoot that greenery and so the emphasis was totally in the natural areas of green adu and the green lend adu correct ah kedachadukaprom we are next trying to do uh, areas which are not so green you know we are looking at those beautiful things which are in the intermediate area so or twilight la shot edukirado alati or malai la shot edukirado இதெல்லாம் வி வென் வி வர் ஷூட்டிங் லைக் வென் ஐ எம் ஷுவர் வென் சந்தோஷ் ஷூட்டிங் அண்ட் ஐ வர் ஷூட்டிங் எங்களுக்கெல்லாம் ரெயின் டிஃப்ளெக்டட் மிஷின் கிடையாது ஸோ ஒரு கொடை வச்சுட்டு கொஞ்சம் ஷீட்டு போய் பிடிச்சி அந்த தண்ணி உள்ளாம விழாமல் இருக்கணும் அதுக்கப்புறம் அதே தொடக்கணும் அப்படி தான் வி ஆர் ஷூட்டிங் இந்த ஆனால் அந்த மழையில் எடுக்கிற விஷயந்தான் விச் மேக்ஸ் உயிரே சாங் தட் ஒர்க் ஆர் சந்தோஷ் கேப்சரிங் அந்த பனியோட அந்த ஃபீலிங் ஆஃப் யூனோ ஆஃப் ஸ்னோ ஃபார் த ஒரு புது வெள்ளை மிழ வாட் ஹீஸ் கேப்சரிங் வித் தேட் அண்ட் எனக்கு ரொம்ப ஞாபகம் இருக்கு வென் ஐ சா ரோஜா ஃபிலிம் ஃபார் த ஃபர்ஸ்ட் டைம் சின்ன சின்ன ஆசை ஸ்டார்ட் பண்ணுறதுக்கு முன்னாடி ஒரு மூணு ஷாட்டில் ஒரு 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 பலூன் வச்சுட்டு ஹி உட் ஹவ் கான் அப் ஒரு ஷாட் அந்த ஷாட் வி ஹவ் நாட் சீன் இன்னைக்கு ட்ரோனில் வி கேன் டேக் தட் ஷாட் வெரி ஈஸிலி பட் அப்போ ஒரு இனோவேஷனாக இருந்தது எப்படி Oh, the tenda mele camera board the you know there was an excitement in the audi- audience you could feel ayyo your camera engeyo porude so we were innovating and trying to bring different aspects to give the audience a uh, or, or wow factor mm-hmm. and the wow factor will last for some time after that conventional storytelling will come down so color vandappo realistic natural lighting um and the light soft a irundha ad control pandrathum important a irundhathu adhe maadhiri digital varumbodhu digital pic image romba sharp a irukku adha eppadi soften panni ad control pandrathu and the or struggle ku apra or normal see vandittu ellarkume ipo purinjichu eppadi kedaikirathu now the question is what can you do again with the image to Uh, and the image and the edge ku kondu varudhu you know how to make that experience uh, different ipo nama institute la padikumbodhu 1981 la probably in the number of photographers in madras oru uh, aayiram per irupanga still photography pandrudhu cinematographers oru 300 400 per irupanga so ungaloda poti for your image was 1500 people into maybe four states 6000 people neenga kaapi pandringa ana innikku enna vishayam sonna madras city la there are 1 crore people and probably half a crore people who are taking pictures on their phone avanga tiktok la podranga avanga iphone la edukranga so and the and the everyone is a photographer today appo nammude work is now competing with ellarodiyum avangalude avangalukku ellarkume arivu irukku and the arivode namm oru pudhu experience kudukiradhu adu romba oru what can i say it's a, to make our theater la vanda and unga padathai paakumbodhu avangalukku or wow factor kudukirathu is a big responsibility for a cinematographer santosh sir innovation padrathukku adhigama neenga yosichathu kediyadhu you have always been innovative but enoda kelvi enna na talapathi padathila avlo periya superstar irukkaru abdikumbodhu nariya shots vanda avaru sill out la kaamikinu abdingra thought eppadi vandathu adha vandu neenga yosikkilaya what were the discussions between you and mani sir so actually when the script was discussed we decided that okay since it's a, a talking about mahabharata let us uh, somehow bring that flavor into the film without actually trying to make it uh, you know 
to find that kind of a metaphor. You know, so mm. the whole idea of the sun and Karna being the born out of the sun. So we brought in that element. And it also was very interesting because it's also a life of, full of contrast. And, you know, so we thought it would be interesting to have all these uh, fantastic images of silhouettes and things like that. And also on top of that, the uh, 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 skin tone is very much, uh, you know, very much interesting to use when you use uh, that warm golden light. You know, most of it was done artificially, actually. But uh, because I used to use all those old tungsten lights was with huge sources, actually. So that, you know, it would not be like a direct this thing. So we have uh, tried things like that. So it actually all went, uh, came together like that, the film, uh, the whole right. idea of that. Santosh, sir, please, uh, our appa get a, in the very padikin, you know, camera, pati, visuals, pati, padikin, you know, which you have mentioned, but in the, you know, on the, rendi per me, film student, on the number, you know, on the car, Nariya Padangal experience recre technicians down the demand at the month. So, coming from uh, Film Institute, Unglakan reception every day, the Varumbo is starting. And the 1980s time, you know, Film Institute students are coming into the industry. Adi Kumunadi, uh, it was largely people who were experienced uh, by this, but it had already Urmadri, Matra Mandir, because Balu Mendra had come, he had changed the film industry completely in South, you know, and PC had already come in. So, Analum, to get an assistantship was uh, difficult because in the institute, people only will take you. Coming in is a very difficult thing. So, I could not become anybody's assistant. Some people are working with Ashok Kumar, some people are working. And I am going to show you that you can see 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 so the steady cam operate pandra the steady cam operate pandum bodu nama pala pala shooting la poi eppadi nadakkiradhu nu kattukitte na or kurupitta or cameraman kitta na assistant ah poi vela pannala but pala cameraman kitta endu nare vishayangal kattukitte da na you know valandha adu ulla enter pannum bodu konjam difficulty irundhathu but ipa it's uh, it, these are things it's very easy or neenga or short film edutha ungalku or chance kedaikkiradhukku konjam easier a irukku should experience After I went to the institute, I realized that this was a place where very like-minded people come. Basically, I went to the institute because I wanted to shoot some black and white films. Because I was very fascinated with Subrita Mitra's camera work in a film called Devi, which I saw it just when I passed out of school. So I wanted to be, you know, into that kind of photography. I, I loved that. Um, but when I went to the institute, you of course got influenced by a lot of uh, cinematographers and their work and different cultures basically. The reason why I wanted to be a cinematographer is because I like that. I wanted to travel the whole world like that, which fortunately has more or less happened. But I'd like to travel all kinds of places. So what I did was at the institute, I found a way of making some money okay, okay. To, finance, to finance my travel actually. So what I did was because I knew still photography, there was a park very near the institute called Kamala Nehru Park. So I would take all these tele lenses and free black and white film and everything and take pictures of children on the swing and the mother holding onto them, old people walking. And then next day I would make prints of it and sell it to them. So with that, I would take off the camera and then just go on trips to places like uh, uh, Madhya Pradesh, which later on became locations for my film, which I directed later on. Was it a result of your fascination for uh, black and white uh, photography? It is not actually black and white. Basically, when you say uh, it is monochrome, actually. You know? So you have a liking to it. See, whenever you make a film, it is always a joint kind of a thing. You know, it is no, no, you don't take a decision like, okay, we will do like this. But then, of course, film can embrace all this. And it is always a, a very big role of also the art director, the costume designer and everyone, you know. And also, I feel that most cinematographers basically love nature and everything. So, more or less, you will find them that they have a Zen-like quality amongst themselves. So, they are okay to deal with, you know. So I think uh, somewhere along the line, everything is should be seen as if it is a 
first thing you are seeing in your life you know that kind of a thing that is how i possibly maybe that is the way it should, should happen i think and you guys two people in the age when you were caught up cameras uh, photos indha ma nariya cinematography sambandhapatta nariya vishayangal interested ah irundhalo rendu perume or point of direction ku vandinga so what made you do that why why did both of us get to direction eh direct panninga I'm a director but ye direct panninga kekkala ha de odike venda ye enda direct panninga nu kekkringa what made you uh, uh, to choose direction ketringa olunga camera panni okka ஒழுங்கா கேமராவே பண்ணிருக்கலாமே நீங்க ஏன் டைரக்ட் பண்றீங்கன்னு கேக்குறேன் நம்பவே முடியாது Yeah. I actually didn't want to assist anyone because like uh, you know uh, even technically I was very interested so I actually joined master little bit of still photography and I would do a lot of uh, still photography on a very professional level I also took that opportunity to teach people you know teach children so uh, I took a job in Arunachal Pradesh I thought it was next to Andhra Pradesh at that time you know and then they took me to <laughs> Himalayas actually <laughs> they took me to Himalayas so there i used to take uh, you know teach all these tribal children photography first time they seeing all this actually it was very interesting because i also learned quite a bit from there also uh, one day these children wanted to bury their dog so they used to bury the dog under a tree 6 feet deep and then i said why 6 feet because it's getting darker and it is a little worrisome so they told me that we have to bury it like that because then only the tree will become the dog will become the tree you know so and that everything that has life has to have a mystery you know if there is no mystery there is no life and then if you look at it on a you know gray scale kind of a thing you have everything from black to the whites you know uh, the tree might be the roots might be very carnivorous but it has flowers and you know beautiful things happening so it is a very interesting kind of a thing i felt i learned so we had these kinds of very very strange uh, learning experience there so my first film was a directorial venture i made a film there with these people who had never seen films before it is a film is called story of tiblu it is a one off film fictional film where i made them talk in their own language and i made a film that time in 16 and that was my first film actually uh, so i directed that film and then i got a lot of awards for it including the idp award and all that stuff and then they wanted to give me a lot of films to direct uh, like short films and all that so i said no 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 i want to actually first learn everything shoot i want to be a cinematographer you know but the direction side is always there it is just uh-huh. lying suppressed so you wanted to do but then you also found that it was very interesting to do all these uh, big films make some money and in so trying to find a producer to experiment your own films you know uh, you might as well produce it on your own like that so it was a very interesting way to uh, do a parallel kind of a thing you know so even now i have actually directed a tamil film just now with yogi babu yogi and, babu uh, manju warrior and all that in tamil it's called the centimeter actually yeah okay. in malayalam it is jack angel but it is saubin and all these people right that kind of thing yeah so sir rajesh sir i think a um, person who is doing photography will always uh, you know get good visuals and all that but cinematography la like, you know you are you have to be interested in the kadai you know so you have to be a storyteller stand or kurpitta nalla shot eduthalum adai eppadi camera movement valiyaga neenga adai and the information or function of time a solreenga so in that or time ku la neenga eppadi or shot or vishayathai reveal pandreenga idella or cinematography ku interest varum so appo epovume or scene edukumbodhe sir eppadi sir scene start pandrathu endha shot vech start pandrathu so in the scene straight a long shot la vechi artist ulle enter panniya adu or drama madiri irukum ana adoda first shot will decide on the on the on the scene ode emotion enna so nama silapa mysterious a start pannuvom silapa sometimes it will be like a or comedy a start pannalam so sometimes adu and the scene start pannum bodhe neenga sirike vekkana avangala sometimes she so beautiful nu irukra shot irukku already or nature ivlo alaga irukku you know so you will be doing various things to uh, tell your story through the camera so uh, 
so each person has a certain or or style develop aidu and the style develop avumbodu adoda inaindu or kadai kedakkumbodu we have to uh, develop a certain style and, and the or cinematographer ungalku or style um and the kadai um maatichna it will be it will work so okay. as a when i was doing minsara kanavu adu or musical அது மியூசிக்கல்ல அது எங்க நடக்குதுன்னு சொன்னா அது மொத்தமா ஏவிஎம் ஸ்டுடியோக்குள்ள நடக்குது அது ஒரு டைப் ஆஃப் என்ன சொல்றது ஒரு ஃபேண்டசி லேண்ட்ல லாலா லேண்ட் மாதிரி இருக்கிற ஒரு இடத்துல அந்த கதை நடந்துட்டு இருக்கு வேறஸ் இஃப் யூ லுக் அட் டெரரிஸ்ட் ஐ குட் ஃபீல் யூனோ சந்தோஷ் டெல்லிங் த ஸ்டோரி பை ஆக்சுவலி சேஞ்சிங் த லென்ஸ் யூனோ ஐ குட் ஹி வாஸ் டெல்லிங் த ஸ்டோரி ஸோ விஜுவலி யூ டோன்ட் நீட் தேட் மச் டயலாக் வென் யூ ஆர் டூயிங் தேட் so each person uses certain techniques which are you are strong in to tell the story or exercise use pannama ungaloda and the narrative style ku or or peculiarity kedacha audience will say i the ivaroda style madri irukku so and the or 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 theedal epovume or cinematographer ku ulle irukum ana adukarla correct kadai maatikichina it it works what are you working on sir rendu perume edhula enna panitirukinga so something is going up yeah i'm actually planning to do a hindi film uh, i'm directing a hindi film and then i'm also working on a web series actually uh, but most of my time um, i spend also in my um, i'm making a mini forest in pondicherry near pondicherry so okay so i'm doing a lot of different different things actually but the, maybe the hindi film i start uh, uh after all this is over maybe august september like that if it gets over then yeah great right. that's why i'm stuck in bombay now aha uh-huh. <laughs> okay rajesh sir i am uh, writing something for a web series now uh, i mean the writing stage so the lockdown is actually helping me mm-hmm. uh, we have to it's writing and rewriting and working with a team so uh, in some ways i'm kind of okay with the with that with that with that present situation because i'm not in for a padila or shooting nadandirundha shooting block aichna it is very difficult to keep a unit together and all that i am fortunately not that situation so i am writing a web series now and uh, i also writing a, a different kind of a film so these two projects i'm writing and adellama institute le teaching students and running the outdoor unit so many things are happening in okay. one's life and of course i am a perpetual student so edavu onnu vaasichindu irpen you know like fascination for history right now so like <laughs> so thank you so much sir it was a very engaging very interesting conversation with uh, both of you ungal rendu perum or or frame la you vechi interview pandradengiradhu romba sandosham thank you for joining us sir thanks okay, thanks bye. thanks Randy, bye bye okay. bye 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 okay. bye bye, bye. bye. வாய்ப்பை பெறுங்கள் உடனடி வேலை வாய்ப்பிற்கான உயர் கல்வியை வழங்கும் அசட் இன்ஸ்டிடியூட் ஆப் டெக்னாலஜி சென்னை மற்ற